hello everyone and welcome to the sob 3d youtube channel once again we are now at the last part of the nino dev kit introduction series thank you all for sticking around to the end i hope the videos thus far have been great if you haven't seen them already go ahead and check out the preceding videos in this series so that you are up to speed with what's been going on thus far in this series in this last part of the series we're going to be looking at how to to rig and import our item into the IMVU Classic client. Since we covered rigging in the last part, we won't dwell too much on the details again, so be sure to check out the previous video in this series for that. Without further ado, let's get started. So we're using the blend file tagged Classic for this tutorial. Of course, we'll need to import our clothing item, so go ahead and import your item into the scene. The Classic blend file scene is 100 times larger than the previous two so apply all transforms and scale up by 100 proceed to transferring weights from the base body to the shirt with your clothing item selected go into the modifiers tab and add an armature modifier use the skeleton as an object test the results of the weights transfer by rotating bones in your armature or dragging the timeline also be sure that your materials are in order assign your baked textures to the color node of the principal BSDF make sure nothing is connected to the alpha as this affects the opacity unless needed export your rigged item by first selecting it then shift selecting the armature and exporting as an fbx keep in mind you have used the settings from the previous video when exporting your fbx as well open up the classic client and locate the base product for the item you wish to derive from in shop since this is a top we'll be using the nino top dev key product as our base open up the products web page scroll down and click derive from product once the scene is done loading in the IMVU classic client go to fbx import and load fbx select the fbx you just exported type in 0.01 as the scale set the id to 70 or any number you know won't clash with other products and verify your textures are in order click on import and then apply changes set your materials to two-sided and import to your mcg jpg as an opacity map for the material in id 00 so that the avatar skin shows and that brings us to the end of this tutorial and series as a whole it's been a pleasure doing this thank you all for watching i hope the series as a whole has been helpful be sure to share this series with people who would like to learn how to create 3d clothing items for imview and other related problems don't forget to like this video and subscribe to this channel for more content like this leave your questions and comments in the comment section and thank you once again for watching